difficulty? So actors Columbus short relationship remarks ignite firestorm on social media. Columbus short recently ignited a firestorm of controversy with provocative remarks implying that non-black women possesses superior relationship skills compared to black women, citing cultural examples to support his claim. You guys, it's about to get really messy. But before we get right into this video, hey kings and queens, welcome back to the channel's girl royalty, back with another celebrity relationship gist. To our returning subscribers, you guys are the re-MVP. And if you're new, you're so welcome. Please consider being a part of us by hitting the subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell to not miss another video. And please do like this video, it does help our channel. Thank you. During an appearance on the Unqualified as F podcast, the actor expressed his preference for non-black women suggesting they have been culturally trained better. The 48-year-old actor who is currently married to Ada Abramian, a non-black publicist, argued there is no respect of the black man by a black woman, clarifying his comment applied to some and not all black women. He went on to say non-black women are taught things that some black women aren't, citing examples from Persian, Armenian, Mexican, Asian, Korean, and Japanese culture. He emphasized that these women were culturally trained to fulfill traditional roles more effectively. When the host mentioned that women from various backgrounds are also taught to be submissive, Columbus Short responded, but it's more than subservient. He said, don't get it twisted, I know you know how to cuss a man out thoroughly, but as soon as you're cussing him out, you're still making dinner, you're still washing his clothes, you're still cleaning the house, you're not doing that with, this is my job, that's just what you were trained to do. It's okay. a different Ooh. energy. It's not okay. like maybe, okay, thank you for your criticism, thank you for your honest, constructive yeah. criticism, and you know, we can get it better. Or cook it for yourself. Yeah. You want a cup of noodle? You want some ramen? He kept on firing the black woman saying, how you want to ride in a Bugatti? How you want to go on a yacht, but you don't know how to wash your own clothes? You don't know how to vacuum? It's a different energy. It's not like, okay, thank you for the criticism. Thank you for your honest, constructive criticism. Well, 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 guys, his assertion quickly stirred a robust response on X, formerly known as Twitter, while users promptly highlighted Short's tumultuous personal history, including past allegation of domestic violence and mercy divorces from his previous ex, who apparently is a black woman. While relationships are undeniably intricate, the essence of mutual respect, effective communication, and shared values transcend cultural boundaries. It's essential to engage in the discourse with empathy and a willingness to listen openly. In the midst of public scrutiny, Columbus short comment have underscored broader conversation about race, gender dynamics, and societal perception of relationship. Yes, he's been dragged with his past or his past has come up, but I guess people cannot ignore it, especially when you're staring such robust conversation in what looks like putting down your own race. And I realize that I um, seriously offended um, my black women in, in a way that was not intended. I think that clip was taken out of context. I know that was clickbait um, because the full answer to the question, which was uh, why are black men dating outside of their race, marrying outside of their race? And my answer was, it was, it was lengthy, but that clip was sizzling, I guess, and um, should have been in my honest opinion, I feel like every race, every society, every community, various household and women from different backgrounds are being taught and trained, you know, maybe differently, but they definitely have been taught. And I also believe every culture still have both responsible and irresponsible women. It just all depends on personal development. Have you developed yourself to say, I'm going to be this type of woman. I'm going to be in tune with my femininity i'm gonna be in tune with who i am i'm gonna be submissive i'm gonna be loving i'm gonna pour into my partner why not neglecting myself it just depends on personal development as per every individual woman and not really race background or what of you that's just my thought the controversy serves as a reminder of the complexities involved in discussing sensitive topics urging us all to approach dialogue with sensitivity and understanding 
But you guys, what can you say about Columbus Short's controversy? It is definitely reminding us all of the power and responsibility in our words. Don't ever forget, y'all, to be cautious when speaking about other people. But you guys, that's it pretty much in this video. If you got to this point of the video, I'd like to hear your thoughts on what Columbus Short had to say. And also, do not forget to like, share, subscribe, and turn on the post notification bell to not miss another video. And until the next one, remember to pray, work out, work smart, and slay. Bye-bye. Thank you.